How's it going, everybody? My name is Zombie Peter, and welcome back to my place. So we're gonna go ahead and just keep exploring here and see what more horrors and corrupt game awaits us. Okay, player has obtained no. Let's take a peek at that. That thing is in the next room. The only way to escape it is by killing it. What if we just don't go in the room? That'd be a pretty good way to escape it. The way to kill it is by using the flower as your weapon. After one use of the flower, you have to wait for it to charge back up its energy in order to shoot again. Keep a safe distance from it and keep track of your health. After you enter that next room, there is no turning back from then. Okay, can we equip this? No, it won't let us equip it yet. We have to wait until we're actually being attacked before we can put it in. All right, let's fight. Hello, floating blackhead thing. Do we poke you? Can we, can we equip the flower? Okay, can we... Can we can we equip it now? Can we? Okay, why am I jumping? Sprinting, 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 sprinting. I don't even know if our flower's equipped, but it's charging. Yeah, this is at least some kind of badass boss music. Oh, this is actually pretty cool. As long as we don't get hit. Where is it? Oh, it's right behind us. Hi. How's it going there? Dark head. Hi. Hello, oh, God, he's right behind us. Oh, fucking sprint. Sprint, 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 sprint. Run in circles. Can you charge faster? Why am I jumping? That, that didn't do a whole hell of a lot. 80%. Come on. 90%. Where the fuck are you? Okay, he's right behind us still. Shake the flower. Shake, shake, shake. Shake the flower. Shake it. Okay, no. Fuck you. Okay. Wow, that did like a third. So ooh, that's a pretty neat attack. Okay, so we have to do like three, it looks like. Looks like it's going to take three to kill Darkhead. And we just, until then, we're just going to keep running in circles. I guess we're just getting our cardio in for the day, or something along those lines. 90%? We only need one more here. 100%! Shake it! Shake it! Hit him! Kill him! Die! I don't know if we need to look at him, but we did. Okay, why can't we- we can't look. We can't move. There's a- there's a dark heart there. There's a black heart. Can we pick it up? Can we move? Why can't we move? And I can look at my me- oh, no, I- now I can move. What the hell was that? Wait, so do we want- we, we want a white. We want a white heart, right? No, it's a dark. Wait, it was just white. We, we already have the key for the dark heart room. We need the white one. Well, I, I, I guess that's it for the boss fight. And now, what do we do with the dark heart? Is that it for here? What? What is that? That wasn't there before, was it? No, this is. This is definitely different. That was definitely not there before. What? What is this? It is a, a stick. It's a board. Oh, it's a bridge. That's what the thing was earlier. Still didn't know what it was. But now we have the lever. And, oh god, I forgot that we still haven't even explored the basement yet. Wow. So we still have the light heart room and the bridge and the basement to explore. I don't know what we use the dark heart for. Uh, this heart represents evil and darkness. Maybe this heart could be useful for something. So I guess we're just going to the bridge. Which I think was this one, right? Yeah, bridge. So we'll use the lever. A lever for the bridge. There we go. What is this opening up for us? It's more to explore. Yay. I thought this would be like a key or something. Nope, it's just more horror. Because we thought, okay, no, it is. It's, it's a key in here. Basement key. Now we can go to the basement. Is there anything else in here? Why, why couldn't you just have the basement key? Why'd you have to have a whole room set aside just for the basement key? Well, let's go to the basement. And then I'm guessing that gives us the key for the light heart room. And then, is that, is that it? Do we combine the two hearts or something? Okay, basement, what, what's in the, this actually looks like a relatively normal basement. Combine the hearts to make the key for freedom. Okay, well we need to get the light heart. We have the dark heart. I'm guessing we'll get the light heart in the light heart room. Go figure. And then we'll have a key for freedom and then we finally get out of here. Because we thought we beat it once already and that turned out to be a terrible, terrible lie. All right, what awaits us in the light heart room? Could it could it just have the heart just kind of sitting out? Could we just grab that and just be done? Could it take pity on us? 
Well, it actually looks relatively nice. It looks kind of like a mine. It, it looks kind of nice. Why, why are there, there's like scratches and slashes on that door? What horrible, is that the beast? Is that the thing that's been making all the noise this whole time? Is, is it behind that door? Probably is. Is this a hole in the ground? I don't want to go in a hole in the ground. There's no way back. When you that's that's kind of what holes are for. They you know they're not for getting out of. <laughs> and there go my ankles. And knees and hips probably. Well, it's been a while since the game has actually crashed. Oh, what horror are we supposed to witness now? No, we're just standing up. Okay, I thought something was going to come try to eat our face. This room just looks like paper. Oh, oh no, the hole's still there. This is where I fell from. Thank you, I, I was there. I actually made you do that. Can we leave? Ooh, what, what was that? Oh, we can open it, oh baby. Oh, creepy baby. So we can open and close the doors. That means we have to run back inside and hide. Something's probably gonna be trying to kill us. It seems a lot of this game is about duality like there's a lot of light and dark there's there's the hearts there's the statues and there's a lot of shadows and whatnot another flower can we pick this one up a live sunflower okay so we don't need that but we have a button let's push the button let's find out what happens push yes who should we not have done that can we push it again what is what is what Oh, are we going up? Is it an elevator? That's a very long way up. Please say it's gonna move faster than this. That's, that's gonna take forever. Okay, no, it's going faster. Oh, geez, yeah, no, let, let's just look up. That's, that's much better than looking at this elevator. All right, so, at the top, and is it gonna crush us against the ceiling or is this gonna open up or something? Okay, you, you're gonna stop, right? Okay, good. Now we're... Oh, this... This looks relatively ominous. Let's just sprint straight for it. What better way to find out what's behind the door if you just run straight at it full tilt and burst through with no hesitation or second thought or thoughts of self-preservation. I want to know why all of a sudden these doors we can open and close as much as we want when before it was just kind of, you know, go through. What's with these giant bricks? Requires the blue key. Oh, so we're gonna have to find a whole bunch of other keys in this maze area. Oh, and we have choices now. We have lots of choices. We have four choices. Let's go all the way on the left, because the left is always right. And we have a chair. And and that that's it. It's, it's a chair. I guess we'll just go down one by one. Another chair. Is it gonna be four chairs? Another chair. Nope, open. And another chair, oh! A chair with a blue key. Ah ha ha! So now we can use this blue key to open, are these, nothing's gonna come out? So now we can use this blue key to open up the door that needs the blue key, which conveniently was placed nearby, so we didn't have to go too far. And I'm guessing we're gonna have to drop down blue key for the door. I'm guessing we're gonna have to drop down some hole again to go back down because there were other doors that we didn't explore near that elevator. Red key and a television remote. Why am I turning on the television? Sure, let's have a seat. No, I can't see, it's too far away. Let's go up here, right in front of it. What? Oh, I didn't push the button. Oh, I didn't push the button. That was dumb. I should have pushed the button before we came back down here. Now where am I? Oh, do we have to do another computer game? Oh, is it just a note? To get the best ending, finish the game my place. After that, there will be a computer in the ending. Go to it, it will display a screen saying enter a code. Simply enter a light day and there's your best ending. Okay, I can do that. A light day, right? A light day. Okay, I, I really hope that that's actually the way to get the best ending and it's not lying to me. Do we have to take the elevator back upstairs because I didn't push that button? Was this? Oh God, it is, yeah, it's all the way up there. I think that was maybe to send the elevator back down. 
And then the television was just sort of a faster way to get back down here. I'm hoping. Because if we have to push that button, I don't I don't know how we're going to get back up there. I think the red key opens up that door. This is just boarded off. All right, well, other than pressing that button, this is the last thing we have to explore. So, what's behind the red door? Okay, now that one didn't open. That one transported us to another area. Is this, this going to be another fight? Are we going to have to run around with our flower some more? Of course we do. Hello. Hi. Yes. We're going to run around with our flower a little bit more. How's it going there? Y you doing okay? Am I supposed to... Hi. So is this is this Lighthead then? Is that who we're facing now? It is Lighthead. Hi. Okay. And then it's the same music and everything. Is it the same attacks? It's the same attacks and everything. So we're just going to fight Lighthead. Not a whole hell of a lot's changing, except we're running our circle in the opposite direction. Other than that, it's going to be exactly the same as Darkhead was. So, we're just going to go ahead and skip to the end here. Oh, he is right behind us. Oh, he is right behind us. Okay, 100%, and you're dead. Did you just die? Did you die? You die. You're dead. You're dead. Okay. Now, get, get the light heart. And that's it. I, I believe we've explored everywhere now, right? All right, well, we got the light heart, and is is that it? I think we've explored everywhere, haven't we? I think we did. Now, is this gonna take us magically? No, this just takes us out of the basement. What was what was behind the one door? No need to go back. Okay, well, that was it. I think we've explored everywhere now. Oh, it was. Well, that was it. No, it was okay. So it was that door. I, th I thought it was the one we came out of. Okay, so we have. The light heart and the dark heart. We've explored the basement, the attic. Uh, we crossed the bridge. So now all we need to do is go back into the basement, combine the two, get the freedom key, and then... Is that it? It's been a while since the rose has talked to us. I find it hard to believe that it's done with us quite yet. But maybe it is? Alright, so uh, enter crafting, hover over an item, and left click to combine. First heart to combine, second heart to combine. What if I combine them out of order? Oh no, it doesn't let us do it out of order. All right, there, freedom key. Yes, give, give me the rose key. So is this the original rose and then the, the actual flower was just kind of like a farce? It's like a faux rose. And this is actually gonna let us escape. The key to the forever tunnel. Wait, where the hell is the forever tunnel? Is that is that this one? It is this one. All right, into the forever tunnel. I really hope it's not forever. Let's, let's just go down. Okay, door's closing behind us. We're not gonna turn around. We're just, we're just gonna keep going. I, I just hope that the knife wielding painting doesn't show up again. Because we didn't kill that. We killed Darkhead and Lighthead. Okay, what is what is that? Why are you here? I don't know. That that was new. That, okay, we're just going to keep going for it. So that's behind us? Nothing? Okay. We'll look behind us when stuff like that happens. Make sure nothing's chasing us. Is it just going to keep doing that? Just keep doing errors? Hello. Oh, this tunnel's getting all wavy now. Game doesn't like what we're doing because we're about to win, right? Yeah. Now, another another message from the Rose. Do you really think this is an exit? Well, the more you do stuff like that, the more I think it is. Although it is called the Forever Tunnel, so I'm hoping that it, it, it's not actually forever. I'm hoping it's just really, really long. Actually, I'm not hoping it's really, really long. I'm just hoping that it's, it's a medium length. This never was an exit. But it is now. Is that what you're trying to say? It wasn't an exit before, but you decided to make it into one? I wonder what happened if we actually did turn around and go back. But it ent what are we entering? Entrance to what? An entrance to the outside world? An entrance for you? Are we, let are we letting you out? Are you escaping the game along with us? Are you kind of... Hitching a ride? I can't let you come here. Come where? 
Uh-huh. I'm so- why are you sorry? What is happening? Exiting. What am I exit? What the hell was that? Well, so much for the Forever Tunnel. Doesn't seem like it was actually an exit, and the game has closed out on us again. Uh, I was kind of hoping that it was going to be an exit, and we were finally going to get out of there. But apparently the corruption isn't done playing with us yet, and wants us to go back in. I don't know what's going to await us. Uh, more boss fights? Maybe? I don't know. I, I have no idea what to expect anymore. But we're going to end this one here. If you liked this video, be sure to let me know by smashing that like button. If you want to say hey, leave a comment down below. Thank you so much for watching this game. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye for now. Until next time.